Welcome back to Man Cave Beer Reviews. Today's beer is Yippie IPA by St Andrews Brewing Company, uh, brewed in St Andrews in Scotland. The eagle-eyed amongst you may have noticed I'm not in fact in the Man Cave. I am in some kind of uh, shelter type deal um, in a little place called Argafen Nature Reserve, which is, it might even be in Suffolk, it's either North Essex or Suffolk borders, somewhere around there, I'll check and put the details up. Um, little nature reserve, just probably five miles away from where I live. Um, I'm clinging on to the last ditches of, of uh, summertime. It's about 24 degrees. Took the dog out for a walk, bought a beer with me. Why wouldn't you? Um, you're not gonna get to see what it looks like, so I bought, it, I bought a tankard so I don't break my glass. Um, so, without further ado, let's crack this bad boy open. I've had this sat in a man cave for uh, for a couple of years. Bit of carbonation now, as you can see on the uh, top of the bottle. Uh, it's not bottle condition, so I can just chug the whole straight in. And it looks, obviously you can't see, it looks a lovely amber. Very clean, very crisp, lovely amber color, and it smells delicious. It smells, has the aroma of a, of a really hoppy IPA akin to um, six point resin, very similar, but uh, not as strong, 6% and there's a wasp on the bottle. Dirty bugger. Anyway, let's, uh, let's stop dicking around and get our face in it, shall we? Cheers everybody. It's not bad at all. Nowhere near as um, resiny as the six point, um, but very hoppy very light, very clean, very crisp. 6%, like I said, so not mental, but uh, but nice enough. Um, I don't know a lot about St Andrews Brewery, or St Andrews Brew Co. I will have to um, do some Googling when I get home. I just grabbed this out of the man cave on the way out. There is some blurb again, I won't bore you with that on the bottle. Nice little bottle, pops all over the label. Yeah, it's good that, not bad at all. But the thing is that IPAs, there are hundreds, if not thousands of them to choose from. Um, so to make one stand out, it has to be really good. This is good, very good, but I've had better. And that's not to a disrespect St Andrews at all, because this is a very nice IPA. Um, lovely lingering um, alcohol feel on the back, which is absolutely delicious. Um, so what I think I'm gonna do is take some video on my walk uh, and edit that, that into this video. Um, so it's not just me sitting there under a tin shell or talking to you. So I'll take a bit of a video of the surrounding countryside um, and let you have a look. Maybe this could be the shape of things to come for Man Cave Beer Reviews because to be fair, there are lots of people sitting in front of cameras doing beer reviews and I want to be a bit different. So um, maybe that's the shape of things to come. Maybe that will be it. Maybe it'll be me out with a dog or me out walking, driving, popping to pubs on location. Maybe that's the shape of things to come. Who knows? Anyway, this is lovely. Probably only gets, <clears throat> excuse me, probably only gets, I know it's a cliche, I always say this, three and a half on untapped. Because I think when you get down to the two and a half threes, that kind of implies the beer's rubbish. And it isn't rubbish, it's very nice indeed. But then giving it a four implies it's very good. And I don't think it's worthy of a four. I would, it's going to be a three and a half, cliche I know, and everyone gives their beer be three and a half on untapped, but um, St Andrews Brewing Co, Yippie IPA, 6% brewed in St Andrews, um, three and a half out of five for Man Cave Beer Reviews. Hope you enjoyed the rest of the video, and I'll see you soon. Take care.